In this video, we are going to learn how to solve application of integration easily in a matter of seconds with Casio calculator. Now, after going through this video, you will be able to solve application of integration using Casio FS 901 ES Plus calculator easily in a matter of seconds. So stay with me till the end of this video. Okay, let's begin. Now note that the method of solving definite integral is used to solve questions involving application of integration where the higher value of x is the upper limit and the lower value of x the lower limit. Very important. So take note of this point. Having known that Let's look at the example I have here and solve it together. Example 1 here says, find the area bound by the curve y equals 2 square root of x. The x axis and the ordinates at x equals 0 and x equals 3. So right now, let's bring the calculator, the Casio calculator and solve this problem together. Okay, the first thing we do will be to clear the calculator. Very, very important to avoid unnecessary error. We advise to clear the calculator whenever you want to solve a new question to avoid unnecessary error. So, to clear the calculator, you simply press Shift button 9. You follow the instruction 3. You want to clear all. Equal to equal to again. So we have cleared the calculator. The next thing we do will be to put the calculator in reduce mode. As you can see, it's in degree. So to change it to reduce mode, you press shift this mode button and go for category four, which is reduce. So it's now in reduce mode. Very, very important to avoid unnecessary error. Having done that, the next thing we do will be to bring out the definite integral sign in the calculator because it's through the process of solving definite integral with Casio calculator that we use to solve this application of integration according to what we noted here. So, you bring out the integral sign, then impute the upper limit value, which is three. Then you come down and impute the lower limit value, which is zero. That's this zero. After it, you move your cursor to this empty box and impute this value of y there. So we have two roots x. We bring out x, we press alpha x. You have to press alpha first before pressing x. If you just press x alone without pressing alpha, it will not come out. So you will have to press alpha first before pressing X. Very, very important. So take note of this. So having done the necessary things, let's press equal to and see what we get as an answer. Okay. We're waiting for our answer. Okay, we have 6.928. Okay, option A is not the answer, not option B. Option C, we have 4 roots. 3. So let's break this value we have here down and see if it will give us 6.928. So let's do it. We have here 4. 
este güey. So you change it to a decimal number. To do that, you press SD. So we have six points nine two eight so option c is correct because this is exactly what we got when we did the different integration for this question so option c is the answer to this question it's as simple as that so this is basically how you can solve application of integration using Cast your calculator. Very, very simple. So, we have come to the end of this class. If you are new to our channel, make sure you subscribe to our channel for more of our videos. Also, like, share, and comment on this video to tell me what you have learned in this video or how you feel about this video. Also, check out for my videos on how to use calculator, cast your calculator to solve definite and indefinite integration. I did nice explanations on those videos. I'm going to leave a link to them in the description of this video below. So check the description of this video below. You see my links to my videos on how to solve definite and indefinite integration with Casio calculator. That's it for this class. Thanks for watching this video.